What is up, my Frosty Brethren? My name is Arctic. Today is Thursday. That means it's Gears of War Discussion Day. Man, today one, it could be a doozy today. Uh, I'm expecting some some feelings to be to be heard in, in the comment section. I'll be looking down there. If you feel some type of way, let me know. Uh, disclaimer. This is old Gears of War gameplay from the Amazing MLG channel. And disclaimer. Okay, so... Let's get started with today's discussion. So uh, I, here's here's a bold statement. I think Bungie has done execution in Warzone basically better than Epic did with Gears of War 1 through 3, Judgment. And uh, if Black Tusk probably doesn't get theirs straightened out with uh, some type of objective, then I would say that they've actually trumped them as well. We'll get into uh, more about that here in a second. But for the longest time, I've been saying, and uh, you can go back and watch some of the videos of me talking about it, I wanted a bomb game mode. Now, for those that don't know, Epic actually tried to introduce a bomb game mode in Gears of War 3. It was tested, just didn't work. The maps weren't there. Uh, but they basically agree with the de design philosophy that execution in Warzone at a competitive viability standpoint, not necessarily fun factor, Competitive viability, it is fundamentally flawed in that you're not actually forcing action between players. Power weapons force a little bit of action, but essentially you can just run around in circles and draw out rounds, which we saw time and time again. Uh, point in case, 2009, Gears of War 2. Uh, Raw Talon is playing some other team. I was Cream, Cream and I, Raw Talon, I don't remember. And uh, they had a three-hour match. Again, money's on the line here, guys. Thousands of dollars on the line. Three-hour match. Delayed the uh, event. They were the last ones in the venue. They finished at like 3 or 4 o'clock in the morning. I don't remember what time it was. The very next event, uh, we had the seven-round rule, which was introduced to basically stop all the nonsense of teams trying to, to run around in circles and, and uh, essentially draw out rounds. Now, this is a made up ass rule doesn't exist actually in Gears of War. There's no such thing as a seven round rule, uh, but it was an artificially introduced by tournament organizers so that they could speed up things and get things moving on schedule. As you guys know, tournaments are on a schedule for the most part. And you can't have tournaments going past a certain deadline because of venue costs and all the hotel flights and all that stuff. So they have to be run on time. Very important for, again, competitive viability i'm not talking about fun factor execution war zone super fun tense moments casual great all that stuff super competitive viability not so much you need an objective to force the action and have something for players to go for other than the power weapons because the objective is to keep their lives safe and kill the other folks so if there's some money introduced the objective is to kill you or and and not have my life taken i'm gonna i'm gonna do everything i can to stay alive right so there you go now what bungie coming back full circle has done is basically listen to this single life round based the ability to revive your fallen enemies wait wait well what is that execution no 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 if you hit the end of the two minute round timer an objective appears on the map it's basically capture the hill at that point if you capture the hill within the 30 seconds of uh, it being active then you win the round if you don't capture it then becomes sudden death at the sudden death point whoever is either standing in the ring or the closest person to the ring is declared the winner you are forcing action and you are declaring a winner or loser based off of the play right you have to make a play in that time period or you can kill all the opponents either way there will always 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 be a winner or a loser and that is what was so important to me about a bomb game mode i always wanted a winner or a loser in single elimination because rounds that draw are ridiculous absolutely ridiculous make a play force a play get some action going and that's what they've done and if i don't see that and Gears of War 4, I'm going to be pissed the freak off, just to let you guys know. That's all I got. I'm waiting to see what you guys have to say on this one. And until the next time, folks, I will catch you all later. Stay frosty.
If you like this video, you should probably click on the one down below. That'll take you to another video. You may like it. A little bit about me. I'm a former pro player. I play PC and console, mostly shooters. I also have a gaming podcast. I do tips and tactics, live gameplays. Check out my Twitch. Also, I work in the industry. Why are you not subscribed?